Marshall Plumley here with Duke Blue Planet. Just stopping by Indianapolis uh, for our game in the Lucas Oil Stadium. Thought we'd check in on former Blue Devil, my brother, Miles Plumley, and see how the upper half lives as an NBA player. So we're going to come check out his apartment right now. Here we are, first steps inside Miles' apartment. As you can see, we got high ceilings, which is a plus for anyone who's seven foot like myself. Don't have to worry about hitting my head on anything. Uh, it's got a lot of character, wooden beams. House has got good bones. <laughs> I think I think I just broke something. <laughs> Taking my first steps into the apartment, you're immediately struck by the Coach K poster, which just goes to say, uh, Coach K is always there for you in spirit, as a coach, as a mentor, and as a poster. Uh, as we can see from here, uh, Miles really valued his time at Duke, and uh, Coach K has been so much more than just a coach to him. Oh, if tables could talk. Uh, Miles has a taste in fine furniture, and this one in particular was imported from Durham from none other than John Shire, number 30. If you know Miles, you know that he's a pretty serious, stoic character, and he's all about practicality. Samurai sword for opening those letters and cutting cake. Uh, Miles tastefully framed this in duct tape. Uh, unicycle, can't afford to ever be late to practice. Primary mode of transportation. Piggy bank to keep his NBA salary. I uh, wonder if there's any way to get any of this out of here without breaking it. I was worried Miles didn't grow up at all after college, but I was relieved to come here and see that he now still values action figures, stuffed animals, books we read in sixth grade and uh, juggling balls. Duke Blue Planet here with Miles is probably one and only friend and roommate, Chester the dog, uh, happens to be a chow. How's Miles as a roommate? That good, huh? And Miles staying classy with the artificial Christmas tree with the artificial snow indoors. Don't know how that works. Uh, in the middle of March, I think it's time to take it down. If you ever wondered what the diet of champions is, here it is. Uh, Miles winning a national championship in 2010 and now playing for the Pacers. Apparently all it takes is a honey-baked ham, condiments, uh, a couple gallons of milk. As you can see, Miles has got plenty of space to entertain and is a great host as we have our close friends and family here to watch the games. And uh, it's not bad seats sitting next to a 60-inch TV in the living room. I'm standing here next to a behemoth of a TV. I think this is the reason Miles wears glasses because minimal viewing distance for this thing should be at least, you know, 20 feet or so. I think we've got maybe three feet being generous. Miles staying on the practical side because everybody needs 30 pairs of shoes, I guess. The throwback Duke Kobe's repping Duke with you everywhere you go. Great deck here. At least he has the Duke flag uh, repping his alma mater and uh, no deck furniture. If there's one thing our parents ever taught us it's never leave home without a snow globe. So here's Miles with his Duke University snow globe. You see the gothic wonderland in there playing the fight song. Hope you enjoy getting an insider's look at Miles' apartment. He's a blue devil that we all know and love and miss very dearly. He's uh, doing just fine here with the Pacers. Chester, just one comment. J just, just one word. <laughs>